so it's come to fruition. Cat-like fans took every possible vantage point as the Geelong and Port Adelaide teams paraded through the packed streets of the city. A Victorian club hasn't held aloft the holy grail of football since Essendon in 2000. The support for the locals today was loud and proud. It's been 44 years since Geelong has won the Premiership. Coach Mark Thompson believes it's about time. It's been a long time um, since we've won one and Port only won one what, three years ago or so, so uh, we're more deserving. Supporters of all age turned out today to wish the Cats well. How long have you been supporting the Cats? Oh, 60 years. What, how, what would it mean to you tomorrow if they won the Premiership? I would love it. No? I would love it. <laughs> love it. Now, who's your favourite player? And Gary and Chappie. Gary Ablett and Chappie. Chappie. Yeah. Chappie. Now, the blue and white of the police, is that we take that as a tip of who you'll be supporting tomorrow? Correct, yes. Oh, it's very special. I mean, uh, how often do you get uh, pretty much a state running behind you? So it's, uh, it's a big day and, like I said, fingers crossed that uh, we can give them all something to start cheer about. Port coach Mark Williams is happy to play the underdog. You know, the expectations all on Geelong. And if they don't deliver that, I'll probably pull the place down. But don't be fooled, plenty of Port fans have made the trip too. Some even live here. Now, are you feeling a little outnumbered being a Port Adelaide supporter? Oh, there's a lot here. I'm from Melbourne. Have you come across from Adelaide? No. So you're a Victorian. Why do you bear it for Port Adelaide? Because my dad does. The Cats are short-priced favourites, but the money is coming for the power. Well, the punters decided to Port Adelaide grand final win because uh, they've been back from 290 into $2.75 and the Cats have eased 137 out to $1.40. The Prime Minister's on the Cats side. I reckon Geelong by 15. But Mr Rudd had to toe the party line. I am married to an Adelaidean and uh, so if it's not Brisbane you back the South Australian team. Both sides had their final training runs at the MCG late this afternoon. Tomorrow one team will go down in footballing folklore. What would, you, uh, what would you prefer, the Brownlow medal or a premiership? A oh, premiership in any day, mate. More honours to come on Grand Final Eve, the AFL...